think the skills that I've gained through studies and use in technology at Bishop would be computer proficiency in general because they teach you how to use Microsoft, OneNote, and Excel, and Word, and all the programs that we might use in the real world, and they apply it to projects at Bishop, and we learn how to use it. The skill that I've gained from Bishop is how to write and how to take an idea in my mind and turn it into words on paper. I think the biggest skill I've gained is probably knowing how to use the MacBook computer. The biggest thing is OneNote. OneNote's definitely a new experience for me. I didn't really even know it was a program, so I've learned a lot about how to use that. OneNote is basically an online notebook, and you can put all of your work in OneNote. You can type on it, you can draw on it, you can record pretty much anything you can possibly imagine you can do on OneNote. We have this thing called Edmodo, and we can use that to interact with teachers and students about assignments and help if we need it. When the students got their own laptops, we were less dependent on the computers in the graphics lab where I teach uh, photography and art history, and in the past also yearbook graphic design. And so it was great because then the kids didn't have to be chained to one chair. They also didn't have to depend on a server that may or may not have been working at the time that they needed it. I think it's really exciting that the kids are able to get up and walk around, take their laptops out in the hall if they need to. They can edit their photographs in the library, in the art room, in the graphics lab. They're not chained to one seat. And uh, they just seem a whole lot happier, a lot freer. And my interface with them has changed quite a bit because um, they're much more engaged. I think that upgrading the technology was necessary at Bishop to keep up with the real world and what was going on outside. We're getting more up to date with what's actually going on. It helps us learn how to use things like Excel and OneNote so that we can be better prepared for the future. It's different. It's not like writing on paper. Everything's a little faster because you have to type faster. I love it. Really, I can put all the homework and the notes and things right onto their notebooks and they can access it. I can watch what their work is. I can see what they're doing. I can check when they uh, answer questions right on that notebook. So I use that a lot and I just absolutely love it. Using a computer in a day-to-day -day setting like in classroom has definitely made taking notes and doing classwork more efficient as you have it all right there. You don't have to worry about getting out your books. You can, it's easy to like reference back while you're typing back to like your textbook or whatever else, your, whatever program you're working on at that moment. It's definitely beneficial to have your own personal laptop with all the programs already downloaded so the students can just have all of that conveniently there. I think the parts about Bishop that best prepare me for college would be the work that they give us because they know how to properly prepare for college classes and they kind of try and mimic the workload that we're going to be getting when we go to college. So people say it would be Bishop is too hard, but they really are just trying to prepare you for the real world. All the leadership opportunities we have from student ambassadors to student council to peer ministry. The biggest thing that prepared me was the writing. I have to write probably a four page paper once a week, which sounds like a lot, but in college, I've, a lot of people have told me that that's kind of the standard, so it feels like nothing. A lot of Bishop kids that are now in college have said that, so I feel like that's definitely gonna prepare me. Bishop prepares me to serve in a world in need of peace, love, and justice from praying before school, before classes start every day, and having mass every month. Everything around Bishop is centered with respect and love for everybody, all the students and faculty, and we all treat each other with like equal respect and we're all trying to be kind to everybody around us. I see it play out with how our students, how we interact with each other. There's not much of bullying or people being mean to each other. There's respect towards the teachers and there's also a respect towards peers and respect to those younger and older. There's pretty much an equality throughout all the students and the staff. I think the biggest thing that has taught me how to serve is we have required community service. It's definitely something that I'm probably gonna continue for the rest of my life just because you become involved and it feels like 
it makes you feel good. And through Bishop, I've kind of learned that. So what we're seeing here at Bishop is a series of uncommon opportunities that our students are getting to partake in. We're empowering them to be leaders, to excel, so that they can go be a light in this world full of just craziness. They can uh, become leaders in clubs, in athletics, in just school spirit. We are respectful of both our students and our teachers. And, and that goes a long way to preparing students for college, for a life where they will encounter many different kinds of people. And I, I think that our position as educators is uh, superb, really. The culture of Bishop McGinnis is what I love about the school. They seem to have a deep connection with one another, the teachers, they are proud of Bishop McGinnis. When one visits Bishop McGinnis, and for those that already have students at Bishop McGinnis, they know that our teachers aren't just teachers. Our teachers are walking on the road of life with the students. They are walking hand in hand, challenging them to be the, be the best version of themselves. They are challenging them academically, challenging them socially to help them become mature citizens. Our focus on the arts. We have a magnificent music program and a totally wonderful art program as well. And when in our society we are beginning to ignore those kinds of things that ab absolutely add to that humanity that we would like to see in our society, I think our school is top notch in providing that for our students.